Steady calling my phone I done told you before that it's over Leave me alone No, it's hurting you to see me gone Dark clouds you What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Sunny. And Simone. And today we coming at y'all with a mukbang. mukbang. Yeah. Today, we are gonna be doing a mukbang with Chipotle. I ran to the store to get some um, drinks and some other stuff. But I got the other stuff, but I didn't get the drink. So now all we have is water. But it's okay. It's okay. I don't want water. But yeah, we gonna get ready. And basically tell y'all some stuff about yeah. ourselves. Yeah, we're gonna introduce ourselves, you know. Let me just chop it up, give us a give y'all a little background research on us, a little information, a little some facts and stuff. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Which one of yours? This one. Okay. It's so hot. And we got on jackets. Yeah, I don't know. What degrees is it outside? I don't know. It probably be like a good little 88. But yeah. So, you know, I go to Chipotle and I always get um a bowl. But, you know, if I'm being greedy that day, I um get a bowl and a wrap. I get just a bowl. Unlike some people. Don't do all that. Mm -hmm. But yeah. So I'm gonna show y'all what if I can ever open it. I'm gonna show y'all what I um. I usually get the same thing. I may switch up my meat and do like chicken and steak, but I got this steak. I got this one. Look like a pumpkin salad. They put onions in mine. That's from the pico. Oh, but yeah, here go mine. You know I'm finna go stupid. Oh yeah. Four times. Scared. But yeah, what I get on mine is I get steak, white rice, lettuce. I used to Topico. Pico de Gallo? Yeah, Topico de Gallo. I get yes. that, lettuce and cheese, and queso sauce. I got white rice, steak, queso, the green chili sauce, a pico, sour cream, lettuce, cheese, guac. She got way more than me. Barely. You got everything I got except for green chili sauce. So. I don't have sour cream. Yeah, it ain't sour cream. Yeah, we gotta bless our food first. Okay, Amen. Okay. But yeah, my name is Sunny. You no, know, I'm an entrepreneur. I play football. I'm six two, two ten. You know, I like to dress and stuff like that. You know, some people be lying on see and stuff. I don't even see it. You know, I just like looking at myself. What you gonna tell me about yourself? I am, but I wanted to chew first. I'm Simone, but my real name is Enaya. I'm 19, I'm 5'3. <laughs> That's not funny. Uh, I do hair and nails. I'm gonna post it at the bottom later on. But, oh, and I'm in school. I go to Palm Mitchell, B School Atlanta. But yeah. Yeah, and I got my own club line and stuff, you know. Yeah, look my, at your uh, arm. Why you gotta eat like that? My bad, my bad. I ain't gonna eat with my arms on the table. That's not table manners. But, uh. Can you scream? I see. No. I'm gonna tell y'all how I met her. So, one day. She's working at this place called Eyes Pizza, right? So one day, me and my family went in there because we found out it was a pizza place and we wanted to try it. So we went in there, and then I seen her at the register. She took my order. I remember that. I remember it. I do not she took my order or whatever, and then I didn't think she was like my age. I thought she was older, like 21, 22. So mm -hmm. I'm just like, okay. So, you know, I was just keeping it calm or whatever with the wool. So then, you know, she bring the food to the table. She was just over there sitting there and I was just looking. So I'm like, okay, she was like, yeah, I just pizza. So then one day, I'm at school just walking, you know, just 
going to my class, you know, I ain't never been that type of nigga that hang around a whole bunch of niggas in the hallway at school. So I'm just walking my class with her, probably like me, two other niggas. So then I seen her, she was standing in front of the door. I still remember what she had on. She had a red shirt on, some black pants, and she had her red Air Max 97s on. But she was standing in the door on the phone. So I was looking, I was like, damn, okay. I was like, I know I seen her before, but after that time, I ain't see her no more. Oh God, I never really seen her at school. Except for Miss Soccer Class. Yeah, and then we had a uh, class together. We was in, uh, what, what was that class called? International Affairs. International but you ain't never want to speak to nobody. She had holes all around her. I was just I chilling. I had no Mm -mm. She had this one nigga that was just buying on her for real. What's your name? <laughs> she had this one nigga buying on her for real. I'm talking about every chance he got, bro, buying. He was so, he wasn't even cute. I'm talking about that nigga was just buying. And then teacher was like, she don't like you. Thank bro, now it was uh, Emmanuel. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but yeah. We just buy So one day, we had did like a little project or whatever. I didn't even need a class. I had all my credits and all that. I'm just ready to get up out there and get my diploma. Period. But one day, we was doing a um, project or whatever. And we had to build like a little island. I call myself Sunny Island. Of course we do. What did I even? I don't even remember what I call mine. And I was just in a... Um, group by myself she had like it was just her like three other niggas it was like, one like I, I had one had partner hoes. she had hoes i had one partner she had hoes. hoes so boom so i seen her i remember that day i ain't no stalker but you know i just remember what my baby had on she had on some gray sweatpants she had on her black 13s and she had on like a black um jacket. And she was just up there at the board, tiny as hell. So I was like, okay. But I ain't never um still ain't never said nothing. Why? Oh no, because I was just um I was just chilling. I wasn't really on that tight time. I was just chilling. For real, for real. I was just chill. I wasn't even on that tight time. Mm. Mm -hmm. But she asked me why I said nothing, why she ain't said nothing, and she seen me. Yeah, I seen you, but we ain't never talk like that, so I'm just like, okay, he just, okay, he's a cute boy in my class. That's it. So yeah. basically what she said was, she wasn't going to hop down unless I hop down first. That's basically what she said. But I mean, I don't even, book. at that point in time, I didn't even know if I was ready to even talk to somebody. I was so used to being like a loner. Loner. Mm -hmm. But yeah. So then, tell me why. We had that class, what, like third period? Yeah, because that was the longest period for lunch. Yeah, then we went to lunch. So boom, that day in, I'm at home, you know, scrolling on Instagram or whatever. And the suggestion list, I see her. I'm like, oh, she look familiar. So I click on the page. I was like, this is her. <laughs> so you know me, work my ones and twos. I like a couple pictures or whatever. And then she like a couple pictures. Mm -hmm. Then I think what I had coming, I think I come in some hard eyes. Yeah. And he was like, text me. I like text her. So look, she hit my DM. Did I hit your DM first or you hit me first? I did, because when you was like, text me, I seen it, and I texted you, like, right up. So, right yeah. Away. So, look, we in there texting for a little minute. This is how I got her number. Smooth criminal. Smooth as ice, twice as nice. Guess mm -hmm. what I guess what I hit her with? Oh, I don't really like um texting on DMs, you know. I don't really like texting on DMs. Yeah, uh, text my phone. Huh? Smooth as ice. She took my song. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So boom, it go Too from there. Too quick to say. As soon as I copy paste, hey. 
Like, I hear back. What's going on? So, yeah. That's how that went. Then, you know, at first, she thought I wasn't one of them uh, guys that like to be on FaceTime with her. But mm -hmm. when we finally did FaceTime, though, I was really just on 2K. That's when 2K had just dropped. So, she was just really watching me play the game. But she, but she was okay with it. Mm -hmm. I think she was watching YouTube videos. Oh, you know that good, good, but hey. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I'm just doing that. This must be fun to me. So, now, we're going to ask each other some random questions. Yeah, how many are we going to do? Cause I got, like, three on top of my head, so we just do three. Three for now, and then if we come up with some more, we'll just... Yeah. Continue as we go. You can go first. Why you want me to go first? You said what? Okay, I'm gonna go first. Let me let me get mine. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna just start off with like a basic question. Mm -hmm. So, like, when the first time you saw me, what's the first thing you noticed about me? First time at like Oz Pizza. Or like okay, school. the first time in the first time at my job, and then at school. Oh, I ain't really the first time at your job. The first thing I noticed was like your face, cause you was standing, you was standing behind the counter. True. You was standing behind the counter, so yeah. Is it was it cute? Oh, yeah, real cute. I really thought you was older than what you were. I thought you was like at least like twenty two. Not even knowing that I was younger than you. Exactly. Like twenty two. First time at school, I seen what you had on. I looked at like the way you dressed. I was like, okay, that's decent. Then you know, I looked, I looked at her. Um, I had to look at them cakes. I had to look at them cakes. I was like, down. I was like, okay, you know, she's decent. You know. I still remember the hairstyle you had. You had like a bun. It was like a whatever it's called. It was a bun. Mm -hmm. Then you had it on. So I was looking at the cake. I'm just walking. I just hit one of them little bags and I just kept it pushing. But I think she almost caught me because she looked up. Then I had to like, you know, turn my head real quick. And I just kept <laughs> walking. So, yeah. So, yeah. I looked at your, the way you dressed. I looked at your buns. You look good. Mm hmm. Most definitely. Okay, okay. I like that answer. Yeah. Your turn. Okay. Oh, I'm nervous. Okay. What you nervous for? I don't know, because I don't know what kind of questions you've been asking. But I'm ready. Some real dear spill questions. Okay. All right. Hmm. Since you did a simple question, I'm going to do a simple question. Nah. Or should I do a simple question? It's up to you, it's your question. Mm. I really don't need, I got three right now. Mm -hmm. All right, next question is me. Um, was you, when I asked you, well, I didn't even ask her to be my girlfriend, I just told her. Pretty much. I just told her. And she hit me back with that, yeah, I'm a girlfriend now. I was like, yeah. Yeah. But when I told you you was my girlfriend, now was you like you was was you hesitant? Mm mm. Why? Cause I was really feeling you, and you like we had a really good vibe. You was you was making me happy, and then it was like it was one of those things where it was like kind of too good to be true because you was doing like everything a boyfriend should do, all respectful and stuff. Mm -hmm. So I was just like. If we were gonna, if we were just gonna stay friends, that would have been okay. But if we were gonna get in a relationship, I was ready to be in a relationship with you. And that's cute. Yeah. Mm. That's cute. Cause you know I'm real respected, man. Mm -hmm. Especially when it comes to my tiny human. Hmm. Let's 
It could be like anything, right? Yeah. Anything. Mm -hmm. What's five things that I do that you hate? That I hate that you do? Yeah. Like, it just probably like a noise. You know. One, when you always gotta have a last word and you don't have to shut up. <laughs> so good. <laughs> always gotta have a last word. I ain't gonna never win an argument because she always gotta have a last word. Two. You're already, aren't you? Go ahead. Let me see. You could be like, man, the last word. Two. I be getting on her ass because she be. Trying to call me on my name and shit, and I'm like, I'm not, I'm not one of those. She already know. I be quick to dang all her ass in there. Three. When she thinks she know everything, like I just use her. What I know is about her. She gonna argue your ass to death. Debate. She should have been on a debate team. Because <laughs> I promise you, it's going to take a lot for her to make her look stupid and wrong. Because with her, if she knows she's right, she pulling up everything. Facts, <laughs> detail, time, stamps, everything. And I just mm -hmm. be like, I don't need argue no more. I just be like, you got it. And you got do. it. And do. Okay, what was that, number three? Yeah. Four, probably. Mm -hmm. Four would probably be like, when she be trying to tell me what to do. Like, I know what I'm doing. I'm doing it for a reason. No. And then fifth, like, she know, I'm not gonna, if I'm with her, I'm not gonna let her pump her gas. If we out somewhere, she be trying to like, she'll grab the door. She'll grab the door before I grab the door. And then I have to grab her by her head and like literally <laughs> bring her back out the door after she already walked in and tell her, now you know we don't even get out like that. So why are you even doing that? And I have to come back out. Exactly. Then I hold the door like, come on now. Why is you acting like that? Oh, that was five. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it's on me now. But yeah. Um. Okay, yeah, this is a good one because this is one I want to know. Okay. <laughs> Out of all of your boyfriends that you talk to, or the dudes that you talk to, who treats you the best? Don't treat me the best. Even though you get on my last nerve. <sighs> I don't even be doing it. I really just be chill, laid back. She get mad because I don't do what she asked me to do right then and there. I be like, I get to it. No, do it now. That's not why. You don't be using your common sense. I do. At all. He does not. I be, I be chill, laid back. I use common sense when it's like something important. But other than that, I just be like, chill, oh, no, baby. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. Babe, look. <laughs> I told you. What I told you? Should I see what it is? I'm screaming. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. With that. I'm screaming. Babe, okay, let me stop. But look up. Keep it up. Did I not tell you that? You did, but I thank you. That's all I want to hear. That's all I want to hear. That's all I want to hear. But no, no, listen, Sonny can tell them something. What are you they talking won't about? Listen. I do now, listen. this is in general oh. with anybody. Sonny could tell them something and they don't listen until the outcome happens, and then they come back and be like, You did say that. I'm not saying it for my health. You know, I said that. Come on now, but yeah. But when I say, and out of all my boyfriends, 
You probably like got the most patience with me. Oh God, could be. Cause like when I say, like even though we still like, I mean we going, we going to be together, we gonna get married and stuff. But like since this is not my longest relationship, since we still in, but we only like you know a year plus. The two, I wouldn't count the whole two years of saying like you've been there, cause it wasn't like two steady straight years. It was more like a you know how people take breaks. Yeah. Then we're like, okay, break. Uh, we probably, I don't know how many breaks we take. We take breaks all the time. And oh, me and you? No. Oh, uh, you're all a nigga. Like, that's what I'm saying. You got a lot. Oh, that lane. And I'm just like, yeah, so you got a lot of patience. And then you used to be real respectful. Like, real respectful. Come on, play about my time you. And then it's like, you be doing stuff for me that no other niggas ever really did for me, so. Crazy guy I had to do that like three times before she gave me a kiss. But yeah. Uh, it's your turn. For real? Okay. Okay. What make me different from all your exes? Three things that you can't compare me to your exes because they never did this or I never did that. One. You tell me like some real shit, like some shit that, that I don't want to hear. You tell me what I need to hear. You, yeah. don't, you don't tell me what I want to hear to make me feel better. You'd be like, if you know, you'll be, you'll be like, oh, you need, you need to get on your, your ish or whatever. And you need to do this, do that. Mm -hmm. Keeping it real with me and not just telling me what I want to hear. You support, you know, whatever I got going on. Like, whatever I got going on. And then, you know, you just do what a girlfriend's supposed to do. That's good. And I appreciate that. I try, I try my best. Even though I'm a headache. Headache ain't a word. <laughs> you like a headache when you get in a car accident. Then the airbag just hits you on your face. Ah. Well, it's my turn. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. I think like what well, this like the last question. Yeah, and then I would have I would have one one two. Yeah. Okay. Let me see. Let me see. I'm gonna say that question for. I'm gonna say that question for another month, man. Okay. Yeah. What question? Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right. Let me was see. that the question? The question that you just asked me was that the question that you? I asked you about before when you said that you was going to ask me, but you asked me in the mukbang and you wouldn't tell me. Uh-uh. Oh, is that the one you're talking about? You asked me another one? Yeah. But wait, okay. No, no, don't worry about it. But um, what I was going to say, though, um, hold up, think of one real quick. It's like the fourth one, though, for me. I did like four. Mm-mm. I did do, um, your third question. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. It's like the fourth one. All right, so. Okay, let's just keep going anyway. Let me see. What made you, what made you stay committed to the relationship? Out of everything <coughs> we've been through, what made you stay committed? Well, for one, when like the little petty arguments that we do have never really has been about no cheating allegations pretty much or like no disloyal type shit for real. Then on top of that, I trust you. Like you make me feel comfortable enough to trust you when you're not with me. Or like basically I feel like you can handle your own when I'm not there. Then on top of that, I mean, you be preaching about loyalty and how you go hard for this, that, and the third. And I'm just you looking like, okay, well, I mean, I hope you backing up the shit that you talk because you talking real big, real strong right now. I'm like, I hope so. I stand on everything I say. Exactly, and I hope, hope that you're doing that because if I'm over here doing the same thing, I need my energy matched. 
You know you a handful, though. Yeah. And you know you ain't no walk in the park either. I ain't no walk in the park, but I know I come home from work, but you know. But, and I I'm also, worthy, though. Yeah, and I stay here. I stay committed because I want to. I want to be here. I, I like where I'm at. I like my she like where she at. And then. I'm full. That's, that's, you know, I ate like half that, my <laughs> yeah, That's why I had to start eating mine and start wrapping mine up. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, it was good. Fun. Thanks for watching our video, YouTube. You know, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on our uh, post notifications. You know, subscribe to our Instagram. You know. Mine is, well, my right main page is Bad Bitch E. But I'll leave it down because I don't feel like spelling all that. Yeah. Then I got Touched by Anaya for my hair page and at Simone's Touch for my nail page. And my main page is sunny one is dot U N N Y one. But all uh, and I got one. I'll um, put my own um, business page down there and stuff for my shoe page and all that. But all that's gonna be in the um, description box below. What she said. Period. Yeah. So yeah, thank so. y'all. Yeah, thanks for tuning in. And watching our video. Stay tuned for the next video. What we gonna call? What we gonna call our subscribers. That's gonna be another video, so stay tuned. Yeah.